Yes, so hello guys, welcome back to another edition of Sports Update Ghana. My name is Joseph Adamafio, bringing you the latest update in sports. And coming up in this edition, Southampton are ready to offer Ghanaian winger that has come out in Suleimana to Everton on loan or probably sell the player permanently to Everton for 25 million euros. Well, I'm here to bring you all the gist on that particular transfer update. And also, on the flip side, Mohamed Kudus was seen in a very, very sad mood as he was presented to Ajax fans as part of their squad presentation for the 2023-2024 season. We'll tell you why Mohamed Kudus was sad during their presentation on Tuesday. And also, did you know that Ali Dusidu has been linked with a move to join another French league outside that is Lille? Well, I guess you don't know about that one. Well, I'm here to bring you all the gist on that particular transfer update and more here on Sports Update Ghana. So, if you've not subscribed to the channel, then it means you are missing out on a lot. Please do us a favor, hit the subscribe button, it's free, and also turn on the post notification so that anytime I post, you get to see it first. Also, don't forget to like, share, and don't forget to leave a comment after watching. So, let's get right into it. And relegated English side, that is Southampton, are said to be ready to offer their Ghanaian winger come out in Suleimana on loan to Everton. Well, Everton have expressed interest in getting the Ghanaian winger. Unfortunately, they were unable to get Kamalden Suleimana in the January transfer window from start really as the player ended up joining Southampton in the Premier League before they were relegated to the Championship. Now, as Southampton prepares for their campaign in the Championship, well, they have had to let go a number of quality players due to the salaries that um, these players take. So they have to slash their salary wages and all. And so they are looking forward to offload some of their players. And that was why the likes of Mohamed Salisu left Southampton to go and join Monaco in the French League ah, and currently Everton are also saying that they are interested in getting Kamal in Suleimana. Now the issue is that Southampton had to cough out 22 million euros to buy Kamal in Suleimana from Stade Rene in the French League ah, in January. Now after they were relegated now they are saying that if any club is interested in getting come out in Suleimana permanently well they'll have to cough up to 25 million euros to get the skillful Ghanaian winger to join their team and now the team that is really really interested in getting come out in Suleimana is Everton yes Everton have always liked come out in Suleimana I don't know why they even didn't join Everton back then in January when uh, the winter transfer window was open come out in Suleimana we understand did not join Everton because they were in the relegation zone and Southampton was a little above the relegation zone but things took a different turn and Southampton rather got relegated and Everton managed to survive relegation. Now with his uh, campaign set to start in the championship well Kamal and Suleiman I'm sure does not want to play in the English championship but rather wants to play in the top flight league so he would want to join a team in the Premier League well what he can get from Everton is either get a loan deal or probably get a permanent deal now Everton are said to be interested but it doesn't look like they are ready to pay 25 million euros for the Ghanaian winger well they want to see if he will be able to perform to his maximum best because Kamal and Suleiman when he joined Southampton managed to score just two goals before the season came to an end and that was on the final day of the 2022-2023 season when he scored a goal in Southampton's final game against Liverpool in the Premier League. So that is about it about Kamal and Suleiman and his possible move to join Everton in the Premier League. Is it a deal that we see that Kamal and Suleiman will end up joining Everton on a loan deal or will Everton permanently buy him for 25 million euros? Well, it's something that we don't know because if Southampton bought him for 22 million euros, why are they trying to sell him uh, 25 million euros? They want to make profits, but are uh, Everton ready to pay up to 25 million euros? We'll, we'll monitor that update and bring you more in subsequent edition. But let's go on and do some more. Well, Mohamed Kudus, yes, his 
transfer updates keeps coming, coming, and coming. Well, the latest one has to do with this presentation to Ajax fans earlier on Tuesday. So Ajax presented their squad for the upcoming 2023-2024 season to their fans and Mohamed Kudus was seen in a very very sad mood as he was presented to the fans. While some of his teammates were very happy and all, well Mohamed Kudus did not seem to be very happy because it appears the youngster wants to leave Ajax at all costs but he doesn't want to join Brighton because well I don't think that the player is excited about joining Brighton although we all know that Brighton will be the best option for him what we understand is that Brighton have agreed a deal in principle with Ajax but the player that is Mohamed Kudus has also agreed a deal with um, Chelsea but Chelsea have not agreed any deal with Ajax so it is kind of a complicated issue and all that that is what we understand so far so Ajax would have to decide on whether they will sell Mohamed Kudus to Chelsea or they will let him go to Brighton which he's not really happy about but Ajax has given the player up to 48 hours to decide whether he will stay at the club until 2025 when his contract runs out because he has not uh, said that he wants to renew his contract with Ajax Amsterdam. So that is the latest update on Mohamed Kudus. And well, next season, Mohamed Kudus will be wearing the jersey number 20 at Ajax Amsterdam. I think that's the same jersey he wore last season. And well, we'll be wearing the same jersey number next season, jersey number 20. Now, before we go, let me tell you about Ali Duseidu. Yes, the Black Stars centre back who plays for Clement Foot in the French League. Ah, he has been linked with a possible move to join Lille in the French League. Ah, Lille are uh, one of the teams that will be competing in Europe next season and they'll be looking forward to build their team by bringing in more players because since the end of the season they've had to part ways to, with two of their centre backs and that has given opportunity for more players to come on board and now Lille are saying that they are interested in getting the Ghanaian centre back that is Ali Duseidu from Clermont Foot. Although no uh, deal has been offered from Lille's side, well, it appears that Lille in the coming days will be offering a deal to possibly get Clermont Foot to give them Ali Duseidu for next season. Well, Ali Duseidu joined Clermont Foot about two seasons ago, and last season was his best season as he made 28 appearances for the French League and side. And unfortunately, he got injured in the middle of the season but was able to return to come and play the final games in the season. So Ali Dusedu might likely leave Clement Foot before the next season starts in the French League and possibly he will go on to play for Lille. Well, that will be it for this episode of Sports Update Ghana. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like, share and don't forget to leave a comment. See you in the next one.